going from being super busy and like really, you know, on all the time to changing that, you know, from work and constituents in Ottawa and Parliament to focused on a baby was was a challenge, but it was a wonderful challenge and I'm really excited about it. MP of Burlington and Cabinet Minister Karina Gould is making her way back to work after six weeks leave for the birth of her son Oliver. I think it's really important that, uh, you know, we're able to show young women in particular that you can both have a successful career and be a parent and you don't have to choose one or the other. Um, obviously, it's it's a juggle, right? You know, it's making sure that, you know, he's ready, I'm ready. We're both, uh, you know, fed and dressed and able to provide, you know, good attention to constituents here in Burlington and making sure that I'm able to do my job. Um, you know, I have to get up a little bit earlier than I would have before I had a baby, but um, it's, you know, it's all worth it. And it's one of those things that, uh, you know, for me, it wasn't a choice. I didn't want to say I'm going to have an ambitious career or I'm going to have a family. I really wanted to be able to do both. Um, it's surprising that on the one hand I'm the first cabinet minister that's doing this, but then again if you don't appoint young women of childbearing age to cabinet, you're not going to have, you know, moms or young moms and new moms at the cabinet table. But I also think it's a really important voice to have there because if we're making decisions for the entire country, we want to make sure that we're taking those experiences into consideration as well. As the first cabinet minister to juggle new mom and career, it's certainly going to be a bit of an adventure for the new duo. It's going to be a bit of trial and error. Uh, the one thing is that I'm really fortunate because my spouse uh, is, you know, um, basically taking care of us and is going to be coming with us. So, you know, he's in the background right now building a pack and play for, for the office here. And, uh, you know, he'll be coming to Ottawa as well. So we're really, you know, doing this as as a team and trying to figure out how it's how it's going to work, obviously, so that, you know, we, he gets all the support and attention that he needs. So we're really fortunate in that regard to, to try and make this work. Now as a mom and career woman, Karina also connects deeper, she says, to this new demographic and also explains that it brings a whole new meaning to a safe and reliable government and country. It's still really new, right? He's only he's seven weeks old tomorrow, so we're still figuring things out. But one of the you know the differences is when you become a parent, you th start thinking a lot more about the future of your country, right? And what kind of country you want your children to grow up in. And although that's always been something that's guided me as a politician, as a member of parliament, as a public servant, it really has a new meaning now that I'm a parent myself, right? And really thinking about the future and you know what what it is that we want for our children um, and so there's lots of things that are going on the other thing too is that I've now entered this new kind of world of young parents in our community who go through you know these different stages of life together but also the different services that we have in our community and I have to say like we're really fortunate here in Burlington and Halton with the amazing resources that we have um, you know, whether it's through the region and public health, uh, you know, I used midwives here in Burlington and they were incredibly supportive and helpful, f you know, for the first few weeks postpartum. Um, and then there's a whole range of services here that I'm kind of entering into. Um, and so getting to know that new community um, has been really good in talking to parents about what their needs are. Uh, I can relate on a, you know, on a much more person to person level now. Karina officially is back to work currently. For Halton News, I'm Kristen Demony.